Why do people use the phrase unborn fetus? Isn't that redundant? In human prenatal development, fetal development begins from the ninth week after fertilization and continues until birth. The political arguments around the reproductive topic always twist and contort phrases to make something sound better or worse, or to hide what's really happening. Some of these get mixed up, because unborn implies it's a whole baby that just hasn't been born quite yet. Fetus then undoes that and swings the other way if it's not a baby it's just a fetus. So unborn fetus is a combination of both sides fucking with language to try and push their narratives. I was just telling my friend the other night, aren't all chaps assless? Saying assless chaps is redundant also. Some fetuses are expelled born way too early to survive. We don't call them infants. A fetus can be born, it most likely will not be one that survives to infanthood, and it is not something most people will ever actually see outside the womb. My first miscarriage, I held what many would call a fetus in the palm of my hand as Hesh passed away. It's just for optics. Same reason why people aren't pro-abortion or anti-abortion, but rather pro-choice and pro-life. The phrase unborn baby sort of implies that the speaker supports the idea that fetuses are babies. That is a political stance in the context of abortion. The argument is that on an emotional level babies are people who deserve protection and fetuses are not people and don't have the legal status of living humans. Because that's exactly what it is. There's also the new age slang of calling everyone younger than you fetuses. I if anyone else did this, but my high school definitely did dot. Ig to emphasize how unborn they are. Ig. Not exactly. A fetus absolutely can be born, and this is quite common, it's just that we call this miscarriage or abortion rather than birth. A developing human is referred to as a fetus from week 9 of a pregnancy, when it stops being an embryo, up until to the date of viability, about 28 weeks yes, infants have survived being born earlier than this. But it's very rare or the beginning of the third trimester, when it usually transitions to being called a baby. Unborn fetus, to me, would refer to a fetus that is still in the womb and has not been born, which is not a given. The Christians love the word unborn. It's also about massively ignorant politically and religiously motivated jerks twisting language they don't understand, to describe a process they don't actually want to learn about, only to exploit for the control they can exert over women. It's an unborn child. That's what I'm saying lol. I think people just say redundant things a lot. It might be a political thing for some, but I assume it's just a thoughtless error for many. Why are you guys C stuck on vocabulary? It's all man-made, you know how most medical term are made in old times. Whatever the hack scientists and doctors wanted to, y'all be surprised that a deformed fetus are used called monsters scientifically too. I just googled the phrase unborn fetus, and it yielded no examples of anyone actually using that phrase for as long as I could stand scrolling down. I also have no recollection of anyone ever using this phrase. SMH my head. Those are called sentence enhancers. 